I opened a little bit more the, the door and I discovered inside four victims. Two on the left side were apparently dead. No respiratory uh, movements, no reaction. Uh, so I presume that they were in cardiac arrest. The two on the right side were alive but severely injured. So I did my first medical assessment very fast and I called the emergency services. Um, you didn't recognise Princess Diana? That's correct. Very surprising to everybody. But you know, when you're uh, the doctor in front of four victims, uh, you have your attention is refocused really on the medical situation, what you can do, what you have to do. And um, it's... It, I didn't care about who she was. I recognized that she was a very pretty woman, um, very sophisticated lady, but, but I, I didn't have the chance to recognize her. Do you talk to people in those circumstances, the, the victims? Of course, I'm talking. Someone behind me in a party probably told me that the victims were English, that I had to speak English to them. So I began to speak English, and uh, and I said, uh, uh, I'm a doctor, and I called the ambulances. They're on the way. It shouldn't be too long. You know, I tried to comfort uh, her in her last moment. Uh, the next day, when I learned that she was dead, she died two hours later, I realized that I was um, the last, um, I mean, my words were probably the last word she could listen before she died. Wow. Um, at what point did you realize that it was Princess Diana that had been in the car? It was the next morning. I left the tunnel without knowing who I treated. And that was the next morning when I woke up uh, before going to work. Uh, I turned on the TV and obviously uh, on every channel uh, there was this big story. Princess Diana died on the tunnel de l'Alma and Suddenly, I discovered that the young, pretty lady I had in my hands uh, that night was Princess Diana and that she died. How did you feel about that when you found out who it was? Well, you know, I thought about that and I, I couldn't have done anything better. You know, I, um, I, don't, I didn't have any equipment, so I, I did my best and I think that that helped her uh, to wait a little bit better for 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 the emergency ambulances i i feel that tragic accident and and, and i'm a little bit part of it, it made me feel very sad yeah.